that have gospels of hip hop in their possession, you can open your gospel to the first overstanding entitled Real Hip Hop. Turn to page 80. In between paragraphs 103 and 104, you will see the three natures of hip hop. Hip-hop exists as three distinct natures. These natures come together to create the total hip-hop experience. The first nature of hip-hop is hip-hop, spelled capital H, lowercase i, lowercase p, lowercase h, lowercase o, lowercase p. One word, hip-hop. It looks like hi-fop. But this hip-hop nature is our unique spirit, our unique collective consciousness, the creative force behind hip-hop's elements. Hip-hop is the name of our lifestyle and collective consciousness. The second nature of hip-hop is spelled capital H, lowercase i, lowercase p, space, capital H, lowercase o, lowercase p. This hip-hop is the creation and development of breaking, emceeing, graffiti art, DJing, beatboxing, street fashion, street language, street knowledge, and street entrepreneurialism. It is what we call ourselves and our activity in the world. This hip-hop is the name of our culture. Finally, the third nature of hip-hop is lowercase h, lowercase i, lowercase p, dash, lowercase h, lowercase o, and lowercase p. This hip-hop represents rap music product and those things and events associated with rap music entertainment. This hip-hop is a music genre. Now look at this. You have Hip Hop 1, Hip Hop 2, Hip Hop 3, the three natures of Hip Hop. Hip Hop 1 is consciousness. Hip Hop 2 is culture. Hip Hop 3 is product. Hip Hop culture is the name of our unique community of consciousness. Hip Hop 1 is the spirit, which creates the Hip Hopper mind which creates hip-hop, the culture, the body, which then creates hip-hop, the product, the expression. Hip-hop one, the spirit, is born of God, the great spirit, the great event. It is the light of our world. Hip-hop two, hip-hop, is born of cultural syncretism, meaning the blending of different cultures to create a new culture. It is the combination and unity of several independent cultures creating a new heterogeneous culture. And finally, Hip Hop 3, Rap Music Product, is born of corporate business interests. It exists when the effects of conscious hip hop and cultural hip hop become tradable material products. We've already learned now that hip hop is not an object, that it is a subject, and that as a subject, it never really enters the physical world. Hip hop is an idea that you become in order to express its element. So right at the beginning, we could see that hip hop really exists in the realm of ideas, thoughts, vibrations, influences, etc. And to handle real hip-hop, such handling must be done mentally. Real hip-hop is a mental activity. You don't really handle hip-hop with your hands. You handle hip-hop with your mind.